Hello everyone, welcome. Monday, new day, first day of the tournament. We've got rush attack. All special skills are set to very fast, and one element is not allowed. It's ice blue heroes um, are not allowed. Let's see. Mm, this is my defense setup. I decided to set it this way because. I simply haven't a better option from reds uh, with high emblems. Uh, also, I was thinking about setting with Telluria on tank and the Mother North on the flank, but um, decided that I will be easy target for uh, red mono teams or red free two teams. So. This is my setup. Let's see how how this works. Ah, mm, it worked bad. I have thirty percent, sixteen percent. So there is a place to improvement this in the future. Okay, let's see the first target. Palladia one with Grave Maker on the tank. Highly emblem team. Teluria Zinkita. So we can take against this I need a cleanser definitely. And the highly emblemed. Hmm. I'm gonna pick, despite it is very fast, I'm gonna take Grezul to protect me and then I'm gonna need, let's take Rigard with costume. Now we can take Zenkita and I'm gonna use under and the hell yeah it doesn't matter I need only 11 level troops to cut the tile and two cleansers yeah it should work let's play for purple tiles yeah and of course I've got blue yellow board they are definitely unmatchable so I need to combo it somehow suggested move hmm Teluria okay I've got this match and I'm gonna use this and pray for purple no purple okay mm. Let's go this way. Alright. At least I'm gonna fire Zim and Grezul. Okay, let's cleanse. And let's go this way now. Some combo. And let's play Satana won't kill my Panther. Okay. So let's match this. Great, so I'm able to stop this site from firing by setting off hell. Great, it was a great decision to take hell. Okay. And let's 
let's drop some tiles on this side okay <sighs> and let's pray not killing panther of course he went after panther fucker okay so i have this protection and now i can go after teluria gone satana gone and let's clear this side well good unfortunately i don't have panther now and let's kill zim kita and now let's go after poseidon great all right that was easy one all right i mean the board was shitty at the beginning but this tournament is too easy because of you can use all fancy heroes and you need only two matches so taking a hell is mm, easy board felonius grew next target kinky misfit minions and yeah this setup should work too Hmm. Let's try it this way. Duh. Awful board, really. Again. Coincidence, yeah. Mono will revive, heal. She will steal my mana. Let's form diamond. This one wanna gonna be tougher. Let's clear it. And um, Albrecht and I think it has that. Okay. I have to kill first. Let's go this side. She's going to fire anyway. All right, Albrecht is dead. Great. Now heal, protect. Okay, let's fire this because Mother North is going to revive and heal some Jesus. I knew that will be pain in the ass. Alright, so let's go after Mitsuko. Now let's let's stop this side from reviving and healing okay now let's kill drake all right all right let's kill seshat and now i can try to kill that fat bitch and again die bitch all right again <laughs> tough board at the beginning but as i said with all 
with Hell and Panther it's much easier. So let's see. Third target. Oh, attack Lulu cannot me. Hi, Ruslan. And what do you got here? Only two emblemed. Again, Mitsuko. Azlar. Yeah, I'm good. Let's try this. Oh, great. Purple diamond at the start. Which causes combo? I need only three matches. Two matches to stop them. So let's go. Not forming diamond. Maybe it's a mistake. But we've got this. And I'll take them to hell. Diamonds. So I'm free from mana stealing. And now I can fire Grazul and Zim. And Tell is dead. Okay, I have protection from Div down from Vivica, all right. She's got instant cure as I remember. And dispel. All right, I'm gonna kill her. And now... I need to regard healing, but let's try this. Alright, Azlar is dead. Only Quint is left. So let's try not to touch him. Alright, then it's death. Thanks. Alright, next. Let's see. Sable. Gravemaker. Two yellows. Yeah, this team should work. Mm, not bad board. So let's start this side. And now let's start this side. Well, great combo. And we've got this great. And Gravemaker down. Now I can kill Greg. Yeah, hell makes things a lot easier. Honestly. This is so easy. I love her. With fast mana she is she's killing this tournament. Yeah, that was a piece of cake. And Vivica dead. Alright, so... Next. Mmm, the tracks. Mono to reds to greens. Mm, Lady 
of the lake minions. All right, this should work. It. Yeah, and with this board, I, I assume no problems. Great cascade. Two revivers. All right, so I have to stop them from. From doing their job. Right and hand out that. And now I can charge again. Yeah. One more match. Ah, almost. Okay. But hell is still working, and now I'm gonna do this match all right panda all right so yeah that was easy and let's kill mono no reviving for you my friend and santa is dead going to fire once probably mm. and uh, great and I'm gonna cleanse and buff my attack and grave mm, panther dead next <clears throat> I used all my flex, 5-1, my defense is working worse, and let's hope that it will be enough to stay at 1% and win this tournament, I filled my chest, let's see, nothing interesting, okay, training hero is always good. 202k hams also all right and mm, how she's so good that i'm gonna give her this note so let's give her this note right then i love her okay i need hams more hams always my troops are hungry yeah i need more hams so i'm gonna take loan from here mm, and this is how i get more hams of course i have to pay it back later but this is how we do it okay i got 300 and this now i'm gonna well that's i need to um free him okay i've got here and my tower so now here no recruits and 300 Camps and I have earlier 167,000 and now I've got over 300 and I can work on these troops as you can see I've ate all, all my one star feeders now I'm feeding with two stars I need more hands so I'm gonna do I'm gonna loan from and three notes and up and now I'm gonna need 600 more before I level up after this I'm collecting ham to do the 10 trainings and I need 1 million 
155,000 hams. When I'm so when I'm here at this verge of almost leveling up, it gives me 300 no five five thousand five thousand hams less because when I level up on 21 level it costed me 5k ham it's not much but if you training troops on the regular basis systematically and uh, every every part of meat counts so doing this way uh, as you can see my second troops are all almost 20 level so it gives you around approximately i don't know on eight and ten trainings you got 500 hams less used for me it's a big amount 500 hams 10 trainings this way uh, at 100 trainings you get 5 million of hams so it's it's a really big number so uh, i'm trying to optimize optimize i don't know how to say it to to do it in the most efficient way my trainings my ham collecting doing raises you can see i'm trying to pick only targets not re-rolling picking them waiting for them uh, for revenges i'm not going to revenge him before he will have thirty thousand ham oh this is my possible next next target with 40 hams so this is how i do i'm trying to um, use very carefully all my uh, possibilities and that's that's how this is how this is how i do it let's see i, I show you my for example let's see this team you can see i've got 29 20, 11, this is the weakest set of troops, but here, let's see, 29, 17, I'm gonna work after I finish feeders from green, and let's see, purples, from purples I've got 29, 20, 11, 6, those two troops, uh, crit troops, I started when I uh, started to play and I got them, uh, so I ascended them, but when I got only mana troops, I stopped. Reds, the the same way. I've got. I I needed them for even, so that's why I ascended them. But only when I got mana troops, I work only on them. And many of uh, my friends say that. Crits are better because of they give you more life, more death. That's true, but uh, you can't allow to ascend five mana troops at once and uh, one crit troops for defense purposes only. And the, the truth about crit troops is that they they are only good in defense. They are they are not good in offense. Uh, w what matters in that green meta even earlier with uh, Guinevere tanks the, what counts what matters uh, one thing matters if you are able to fire your heroes before enemies opponents defense fires back so if you have three heroes with cut sh uh, cutted tiles for example you've got troops 29 23 and 11 and you use zimkita queen of hearts for example and grave maker and it matters if you are able to fire them with three matches or with two matches or after ghost tiling after killing teluria uh, with three uh, tiles uh, setting uh, i mean ghost tiling Th this is what matters so you are able to cleanse for example, the negative effects from Telluria, Vela, or Gravemaker. This is what makes the difference between you being killed or surviving, because that way you you've got more survival, survival, survivability. 
sort of availability. All right, whatever. Uh, so I think that mm, mana troops are the more important and and when I hear that crit troops are great and they are better, uh, I don't know what to say because it's like saying that, uh, I don't know, track, very good track is better than Ferrari. It's, it's madness, okay? Uh, Ferrari is always better than the track. And I agree, if track hits, it hits hard and it, it got more survivability and it can't, uh, when, when the track and uh, Ferrari have an accident, the track will be better, okay. But if you gonna uh, race uh, with Ferrari or track, Ferrari always wins. And this new meta is like a race, you have to win this and you have to be quicker than your opponent. And this is what I have to say about troops. So, as you can see, I'm not pulling troops and I'm doing my troops with one star feeders. I'm collecting this for blue. I'm hoping till the end of September to finish that second uh, mana blue troop on the 23rd level the same with reds now when I finish uh, doing greens to 23 level I'm gonna do my yellow but as you can see I have a very little very very little feeders because because when I started playing I ascended this one guy from crits to 11 and he ate all my feeders honestly and then I have to start doing this guy and when I did twice like 11 I haven't any feeders for for mm, leveling this one I, I waited the long very long time to ascend these troops to 17 level anyway step by step slowly and uh, systematically working it payoffs i'm i think that uh, when i when i will have finally troops at 11 23 and 29 hopefully i will be managed to get them 29 29 and 23 it changes a lot my gameplay will be better i have better results on war so that's why I'm saying you leave your ma leave your crit troops because you are not of course if you have enough money to pull troops and to buy meat ascend crit troops but only this way because mana troops are all the way better during the events even for defense and especially in offense you you can use them they are more universal you can use them everywhere but crit troops are good only in defense so if you are wealthy enough to that you can be able to to ascend three mana troops and the fourth crit troops do it i saw that zero and you you see a pack have crit troops but i'm not sure if they they are uh, glad that they ascended it because it's a a lot of feeders, a lot of ham, a lot of time to, to get three crit troops. So it matters if you are if you are firing your heroes earlier than your opponent or not. All right, this is my rant about troops. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you tomorrow, guys. Of course, like and subscribe, and I hope that uh, tomorrow my defense will work better. In offense, it was great, five wins, but with hell, it's everything easier with when she fires with six tiles. I al I also could take Onadal and Guinevere; they probably would work the same way, but it wasn't necessary. If hell after f two matches is firing, so guys, please leave a comment if you. If you uh, have better proposals, proposals on setting up a defense for this tournament, of course I will next time if it appears in few 
weeks or months I will I will uh, set this defense different way and of course uh, see you tomorrow as you as you saw I'm doing streams live streams from wars probably it will be always 11 p.m. CET time and uh, 6 p.m. C time C E time um, C E T time in on Sunday, uh, Wednesday 11 p.m. C E T and uh, Sunday 6 p.m. C E T. So guys, thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for subscribing. See you tomorrow. Bye.